is Ketnep, one of the most terrifying creatures you will ever meet. Uh, that guy gives me the creeps. Boom! <laughs> <laughs> Meow! I got gotcha, you, Steve. Oh, Chris, that is not funny. And this is my friend Chris, who thinks Ketnep is lame. So now I'm pranking Chris by turning into Ketnep to make him admit he's scared. Ugh. Wait, I can't believe that Chris is joking about catnap like this. He should really be careful, Steve. Yeah, he should be, especially when we are looking for our revenge. I left an armor stand as distraction upstairs, but now I need to get Chris's attention again. Oh, are you okay, little Stevie Wee Wee? Have you recovered after your encounter with catnap? He's not even real. Huh? Who's that at the door? <gasps> Guido, he's on his way. Quickly, turn me into Ketna. Oh, this is gonna be so good. Heck yeah, it is, dude. Now quickly, go hide. Chris has no idea he's about to encounter Ketna face to face. Here he comes. Ah! <laughs> oh, we got him good, but that's only one step of this prank. Now I'll just turn back into my normal form. And Guido, I'm gonna hand you this. A box? Yeah, just bear with me, dude. <laughs> How is this happening? He, he can't be real. Uh, I gotta tell Steve about this. I've only got a limited amount of time to do this, but I'm in. But I've gotta break my armor stand to make it appear to Chris that I haven't moved. Steve, you gotta see this. Huh? S see what? I I've just been staring at this wall. It's Catnap! He's outside! Wait. Are you telling me that you're a little bit scared of Catnap? But I thought he wasn't real and he wasn't scary. In fact, you called him lame. Uh, no, I'm not scared and I'll prove it. Wait, what do you mean prove it? What are you? <gasps> oh, okay, Chris, if you're sure about this. <laughs> hey, Guido, Chris is on the way. Put the box down. Uh, okay, I'm still not really sure what it does, but fine. With Chris heading straight for my trap, all I had to do now was wait. This was going to change his life forever. Die, you foul creature! Huh? A kitten? Uh, Chris, that's not Catnap, silly. I know! He must have run away. Aw, little guy's adorable. I'm gonna call you Chris Jr. What a creative name. Now listen here, Chris Jr. I've had a stressful morning, so I know exactly where we're going next. Oh, Steve, are you gonna explain to me why you just ate Chris a cat? Seems like to me he'll get less scared now. Oh, Guido, let me explain. This was not any ordinary cat. Chris Jr. was equipped with a hidden camera so I could see exactly where Chris was heading next. This was important because if I failed to scare Chris just once, my mission would be over. Come on, Chris Jr. We're gonna share a bowl of milk. Hey, look at Chris Jr.'s live feed. That looks like the cafe. It's just around the corner. Yeah, we better hurry. Hello there, pathetic retail worker. I would like one bowl of milk, two corn on the cobs, five hamburgers, a large chocolate milkshake, two curly yep. fries. Chris is in there, all right. Okay, come on, Guido. For the next prank, we need to get to the roof. A crispy chicken salad, two number nines, and number nine large. Now, Guido, what if I told you that Catnap was just one toy of many? In fact, he's got a bunch of companions. Wait, really? That's right, dude. Introducing Crafty Corn, Bobby Bear Hug, Bubba Bubba Fence, Dog Day, Kickin' Chicken, Hoppy Hopscotch, and Picky Piggy. Now, the fun thing about these toys is that each of them has a very specific scent, which can create different effects. So if we can manage to get the smell down there to where Chris is, who knows what kind of chaos is going to happen? Well, come on, let's get on with it. Okay, okay. Right here, we've got an air conditioning unit, which is taking the air from outside and feeds it inside of the cafe. Do number 45's one with cheese. Let's start off with Bobby Bear Hug. A large soda, a vanilla ice cream with extra chocolate sprinkles, a small salad, a medium salad. Hmm, why does it smell strange all of a sudden? This is weirding me out. <laughs> That's because you're breathing in the sweet scent of Bobby Bear Hug. What's gonna happen? What in the multiverse? Woohoo! Disco time! Oh, this is just making him less scared of Catnap! Hey! Watch this, everyone! Oh, you've got to be kidding me! Steve, fix this! Don't 
Don't worry, Guido. I'm sure that crafty corn here is going to be much better than Bobby Bear Hug. At least, I hope so. Wait, no, 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 what happened to all the hot disco babes? I, I don't like this. Oh, Guido, this is perfect. Chris and everyone else in this cafe has been turned into a stick man. And now he's panicking. Oh, and look, check it out. We got our first power. Catnap claws. Every time we scare Chris enough, we get some awesome new abilities. Uh, Steve, you might want to see this. Oh, hold on a second. Looks like these guys can draw whatever they like. And it becomes real. Let me try. Oh, uh, no, Chris, stop. You're supposed to be getting creeped out, not getting creative. Oh, yeah. Uh, none of these smiling critters are working. Uh. Steve, is that you up there? Oh, no. Please tell me that isn't Sergeant Shaw. The leader of the police. You do realize that trespassing is against the law, right? Get down here, now! Ugh, Guido, I've got to deal with this. You're gonna have to be the one that scares Chris. Here, you take these. Are you gonna be okay? Sergeant Shaw is really tough. Don't worry, Guido, you focus on Chris, I'll focus on Shaw, because I've got my cat claws. Ooh, yeah! <laughs> Now, I can try Piggy Piggy! Ugh, I'm so ugly! Hey! But that does look kind of fun! Woohoo! <laughs> you really thought I came alone? Move in, then! What the? No! Those cops are gonna arrest Guido! And that means Chris won't ever be scared of Catnap! Guido, get out of there! <laughs> Guido, get out of there! Wonder what this one does. Still not scary enough. What about this? And that's not it either. Hmm, this may take a while longer, Steve. Sit tight. Guido! If I don't get out, Guido's gonna be caught. You ain't going anywhere, punk. Well, apart from the nice cold cell I've got waiting for you back at the station. No! The flood! Oh, I've got to save Guido! Yeah! Gotta reach him before the cops get there! I'm running out of smiling critters here! Stay back! Stay that's right, Guido, I'm back! You left? Yeah, I got kidnapped by Sergeant Shaw and I had to claw his eyes out and... You know what, never mind. How's it going with Chris? Well, not good. None of the smiling critters seem to be doing anything useful. But I've got one more idea. What would happen if we combined all the smiling critters to make the ultimate smell sensation? Oh, what the heck is that? He's like combined together from all the different smiling critters. Hickey Piggy's tail, we got Bobby Bear Hug's head. Oh, it's so gross. Well, I guess there's only one way to find out what it does. Let's do this. <gasps> I like the sound of this. Ooh, look at all the colors. I'm ready for more fun. Come on, show me what you got. Uh, hello, Chris Jr.? <gasps> Guido, I think this is it. Help us, Chris. We're scared. <laughs> My friends, uh, are you okay? Uh, I'll find help. Uh, don't worry. Ah! Oh, look at him, Guido. He's totally freaking out. Give me my friends back right now. I'm warning you. Don't make me. Ah! Ah! Run away. Jr. again. Stay back, Catnap! What did I ever do to you? I always thought you were real. I promise! Oh, Guido, this is great! His fear meter is rising! I did it! I killed Catnap! I am the Catnap Killer! The mightiest hero in all the land! 
take this! You know what? I deserve a treat. Come along, Chris Jr. The theme park awaits. And I'm gonna go on all the rides. I can't believe he isn't scared yet. In fact, it seems like we just gave him more confidence. But don't worry, Kuito, I've got a plan. I've always got a plan. What Chris didn't realize is that the theme park was the perfect spot for my next prank. There is a secret, unfinished, underground roller coaster. And while Chris had fun on the other rides, I sneakily got to work on turning it into his worst nightmare. You gave me the wrong flavor of cotton candy, you fool! I want a refund! Wow, he's being a real jerk, Steve! Yeah, ever since he killed Catnap, he really thinks he's the most important person in the multiverse, but that's about to change! But for this plan to work, we need to get inside of that building. Should be simple, right? Oh, oh, uh, hey guys! Yeah, these workers clearly don't want me to go through! Let me deal with them, Steve! Now hold on a second, Guido! Don't worry, I've got a plan! Involving my transformation ability. I'm just gonna get them in a huge bunch here. There we go. And wham! And as you can see, these guys are friendly now and they follow my every move. Awesome! Now come on, minions, follow me! Next stop, the top secret underground roller coaster. This is gonna be so much fun! Yes, this roller coaster track is going to be the perfect place for our next prank. Come on, follow me, guys. We are going to do some building. When Chris gets on the roller coaster, we want him to follow this track. It's going to lead all the way through this cave system. And eventually into another room entirely. Now, the thing is, we can change the direction of the tracks, which means he'll no longer be on the correct route, but will be sent to wherever we want him to go. Oh, I see what you're saying. So if we build an entirely new room right here and put Kenneth inside, he'll have nowhere to run. Exactly, Guido. And that's where you come in, minions. Follow me. We're going to go build those rooms. Guido, you stay right here. Got it. I've got to set up the next roller coaster before Chris arrives. Good luck, Steve. Hey, I demand to be let into the roller coaster. I don't care if it's unfinished. I'm the catnap killer and I get whatever I want. Ugh, you know what? Ugh, there, time for some fun, Chris Jr. I've gone by Steve more times. <laughs> Woohoo! Just gotta wait for the right moment. Yeah! For now, Chris was distracted. So I had to finish up the rest of the coaster fast. Hey, Guido, it's ready! Okay, give you a shot! Chris has absolutely no idea what I built for him. now okay platform number one spin <laughs> what the this doesn't feel right i don't think i'm supposed to be here everything's so dusty hey that's a picture of me looking as handsome as ever and there's another one with catnip behind me but he's dead how can that be possible He's gonna admit he's scared of Catnap! Just look at Catnap chasing him! He looks like a monster! Oh, we've got another rotating platform right here! Let's just go ahead and spin that, and that will ensure that he's going straight into that laser field! Yeah! Woohoo! Come on, Chris! Admit it! You're scared! Just relax! Well, this is awkward. Ah! <laughs> no, no, Guido, my machine is it's malfunctioning. What's that gonna do? Uh, I'm not really sure. They're going out of control. No! Uh, Guido, you might want to see this. No! The platform, it's spinning even faster. How is that even possible?
They... They love me! What the multiverse? I guess this is what happens when you survive dangerous roller coasters. Please, calm down, everyone. And because Chris was seen as a hero, he became famous. From signing autographs, advertising deals, and moving into a fancy mansion, Chris was far from scared, which was exactly what I didn't want. Ugh, this is just so annoying! I wish there was a way to see what Chris was doing right now! Well, we actually can, Guido! I've got Chris Jr! Let's see what he's up to! Now, where is he? Everyone loves me, Chris Jr! They think I'm great! And that I'm not scared of anything! But of course, you know that catnap gives me the creeps! I can't let this secret get out! I'm sorry that it had to come to this! Now hold still! This won't hurt! Wait, much. what is he doing? No, Chris, stop! Oh my gosh! Chris Jr! Chris had become a monster, driven by fame and money. I had to stop him to honor Chris Jr.'s legacy by making him more scared than ever before. So here we are. This is Chris's mansion. I can hear some kind of party music coming from inside. Sounds like Chris is dancing in there. Ugh. Just the thought of Chris dancing scares me more than Catnap ever did. Woohoo! Here, take something you'll never have. Money. I'm the only person to survive Catnap not once, not twice, but three times. Ugh, someone's gonna put a stop to this. Come on! <laughs> Uh, that doesn't sound good. Chris has gotten oh, Yeah, I guess it would be the ultimate defense against Catnap. Okay, this is fine, but I literally don't have any weapons. Wait, what's this? Fireball? I'm guessing I must have unlocked this earlier. Oh, that is so disgusting. Wait, what the fuck is working? The guard dogs are down. DJ, crank that music up! Come on, Steve, let's get inside! This is our chance, let's go! What's that smell? Furballs? No, 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 he can't be back! I watch him die! I've gotta defend my house! Okay, everyone, new party game! Let's play Defend Chris's Million Dollar Mega Mansion! Maybe we can't, but Catnap can! Come on, Guido, transform me! You see, Catnap has enhanced agility, and I think I should be able to jump right into this area here. Ha <laughs> ha! Didn't defend at all, did you, Chris? Now let's go get him the scare of a lifetime! Catnap? How? <laughs> Your time is up, Chris! Please! Don't come closer! Uh, I need this! I can't give up my fame! Defend me, peasants! <laughs> Wait, what are you doing? Wait! Don't stop! Chris, stop doing this! He's Nowhere left to hide, Chris! Wait, is he asleep? Who sleeps with their eyes open? I don't know, but it's giving me the creeps now. Oh, but little does Chris know that he got so scared that he just gave me access to my ultimate power, Dreamwalker. Which, if I do this correctly, should let me enter the dream of Chris. Here we go. What the? Oh, no. Uh, wait, is this? This is Chris's dream. It actually worked. Oh, and I guess because we're in Chris's dream, we can't be catnap anymore. Uh, Steve? Ah! Welcome to the wonderful world of dreams! Would you like some candy, young man? Uh, no thanks, I'm good. Uh, listen, what I'd really like is for you to tell me where Chris is. We have unfinished business. Cr Chris? I don't know any Chris's, but I do know that you're gonna have a great time here. Now, please, eat up. I don't want the candy to go moldy. Uh, Guido, I can tell that this unicorn isn't telling the truth. He knows exactly where Chris is. Don't eat his candy, Guido. Too late. Oh, Guido! Wait, this unicorn must have met up with Chris beforehand, which means I'll be able to see that meeting in his head! Keep any strangers distracted, and if you lose my location, just follow the red leaves. 
Red leaves. Oh, like those red leaves over there. Invasion of privacy! Oh, no, you don't! Ah, there we go. Onwards, my mighty steed! I need a little too much. I'll wait right here. Okay, fine. Suit yourself. Hey, Chris. Oh, hey, dear friend. Welcome to my dream. Wait, Chris, you're, you're not scared? I thought you'd be terrified after everything that happened today. Uh, you know, throughout this entire adventure, I was catnapped. That's right. One of your best friends that you thought you could trust was actually me. Ah, well, would you just look at that? Don't worry about it, Steve. I forgive you. Don't, uh, don't worry about it. Just chill, bro. Oh, no. It's fear. It's lowering. I'll be scared already. Ah! Hey, that's not cool. You're not cool, Chris. That does it. <gasps> this is my dream, so I can be whatever I want. Oh, boy. No, 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 no. Oh, oh my gosh. He's still scared of catnap. Oh, no, no. Yes, no, that's no, it. No. I just have to remind him about everything that happened today. Like, do you remember this guy, Chris? The, the hybrid. And what about these guys? The smiling critters. Oh, and don't forget one of my favorite parts. The roller coaster! I'm... I'm... I'm scared! <laughs> Bye, Chris! He won't be Chris now! He's a complete joke! Yeah, well, he shouldn't have been so mean today. No! 